And as COVID-19 cases continue to rise here in the U.S., should fully vaccinated people be worried about getting infected? Our chief health editor, Dr. Parthen Nandy, joins us now to help answer some questions. First off, Dr. Nandy, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Alan. How are you doing? I'm good, Doc. Thank you so much. So more and more breakthrough infections are making headlines. Do you think that this trend will continue and should vaccinated people be concerned? You know, headlines are one thing, but here, here's a here's a, the real real truth, Alan. If our viruses case, virus cases actually continue to rise, I do think we'll see more breakthrough infections. But I don't want fully vaccinated people like myself to, to, to panic. Here's why. Breakthrough cases are still considered to be uncommon. They're headlines. And yes, you know, they'll they'll make the news, right? But that doesn't mean our COVID vaccines don't work. They absolutely do. They're just not 100%. And we know that we've always expected to see breakthrough infections from the get-go, Alan. The good news is that studies so far have shown that okay. fully vaccinated people tend to have either mild symptoms or no symptoms at all. And for the most part, our vaccines are stopping severe illness and death. Is it possible to die? Absolutely. But it's very rare that fully vaccinated people die from COVID-19. 99.5% of COVID deaths are, are from people who have not yet rolled up their sleeves and got the shots. That is, they're the unvaccinated folks. So, Doc, a lot of people want to know this. If you are fully vaccinated and infected, can others catch the virus from you? It's a good question. So earlier studies, Alan, found that vaccinations right, lowered the amount of virus in the body. So it was unlikely that a fully vaccinated person would transmit the virus to others. But you got the Delta variant, one of the most contagious mutations to be identified thus far. When researchers compared the original virus, Alan, to the Delta variant, they found that people infected with the Delta variant carry up to a thousand times more the, the amount of virus in their body. So does this mean that a vaccinated person with the breakthrough infection can infect others? The, the short answer is we don't know. We need more research, right? But here's what I think. In my opinion, it's a possibility. So here's what I would recommend. If, you, if you're a vaccinated person and you're hanging around uh, another vaccinated people, I think the risk is quite low. But if you're vaccinated and you're, around, and, you're, and you're around unvaccinated people or live in a community with low vaccination rates, then you may want to consider precautions because the risk is additive. What I mean is that the more you're around unvaccinated people, the higher your risk is of a breakthrough infection. That's why it comes down to the basic thing, please get vaccinated. That's why it's so important. If we work together, then we can protect each other and we can stop this virus from seriously harming our loved ones and those around our communities. So I think that's what the answer should be. If you're all vaccinated, then I think you can feel comfortable and, and not spread it to one another. Yeah, absolutely. Some very important information. As always, Dr. Nandy, thank you so much. Have a great weekend. You as well. Thank you. Thank you. And Dr. Nandy will be talking about vaccines and children on this weekend's episode of the Dr. Nandy Show. You can watch it right here on 7 this Sunday at 5 p.m.